let's take a look at what's inside these two awesome looking party games, Throw Throw Burrito and Throw Throw Avocado. So if we're going to be throwing things, in this video we're going to see how safe these toys really are. If they're house safe or even human safe. So towards the end of the video, we'll be throwing these things at my TV, at my wall, to see if they do any damage. I will be honest with you, I was a little nervous doing these tests, but I did them. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy this video. At first glance, the the original box is smaller than the sequel, but probably an inch or so. Uh, it'd be nice to have the boxes the same size as each other, because when you store them, you know, you have the height difference. But we'll see why uh, there's a height difference, so let me um, start unboxing it. But just looking at the, the box itself, it's good quality, has some nice theming to it. And then you can see the actual items you throw at each other. This is the the first one. This is the back of the box here. And it shows you real quick uh, how to play the game there and some nice artwork this caught my eye it says original edition so I wonder if there's gonna be a um, special edition of the game or or some other one but I did see in the store that there's like a large edition that has inflatable burritos that you can uh, use to play outside with here's the uh, the sequel and then the bottom here says play this on its own or combine with throw throw burrito to unlock a new combo game and here's the back all right so let's see what's inside the first box all right let's go ahead and open this one Burritos. Of course, let's feel these burritos. Very soft. Very, very soft. Kind of like uh, stress balls. Yeah, these are good for for throwing, and they definitely won't won't hurt anybody. Very, very soft. Pretty cool. They smell kind of weird. Like I don't know how to explain it plastic styrofoam I'm not sure but it smells like new I guess so we have here the rules two player variants small room variant and two decks if you have two copies of throw throw burrito and more than six players you can combine the games for up to 12 players Side, we have battle rules, multiple battles at once, ties in battle, hitting, misses. Alright, so those are the rules. Fear me. Fear me token. It's a big token. Cardboard. We have here a few dead burritos, looks like. Some tokens here, cardboard, cardboard tokens. There's a little small baggie for the cardboard tokens. And it says put other stuff here. And here we have the decks. I like the colors. Kind of like a 70s retro color. And the cards are kind of like a, some kind of fabric. Uh, it's not your typical, you know, paper cards. Very flexible, so they seem very durable. It says original edition on the card as well, so there must be some other editions out there. Just kind of give you an idea of what the cards have. That's one deck. Floaty goaty, meow cow. Don't look it's just a little weird. <laughs> and then burrito brawl card. A few here. 
Burrito Duel. Burrito War. That looks like fun. Cool. Those are the cards. Alright, let's unbox the other one. Very squishy, see materialized the burritos. They have the avocado texture on the back as well. Now something I wanted to try when I saw this was <laughs> doesn't really like close up because of the eyes, but it's pretty funny. They have that weird new smell. It says do not open. This envelope contains a special combo game that can only be played if you also own Throw Throw Burrito. So, we have Throw Throw Burrito, so let's open it. Avocado War cards, Burrito War cards, so you get a few extra cards there. Scatter Brawl, interesting. And then Double Up Duel. Here it seems like there are the instructions for the throw throw avocado and throw throw burrito combo game. Three to six players. It says, Did you open this before you bought throw throw burrito? Go get it so you can unlock this super special combo game. And we have the instructions on how to play with both sets, both games. Cool. Looks like fun. So same as the other one, we have the rules here. So it doesn't matter which version you get. You can get the burrito version or the avocado version. The, um, the rules are going to be the same. You're either throwing burritos or throwing avocados. And then we have the fear me token. Same as the other one. Just big, big hardware token. We have the other tokens here, the dead avocado with this seed out, <laughs> and the plastic bag to store the cardboard. Same kind of theming with the green and the like, retro feel. So here's some of the cards here, a lurky turkey, frosted salmon salmon, <laughs> vomit comet. Stagecoach Roach, Muffin Puffin, Moose Goose, Perm Worm. Then we have Brawl Cards. Avocado Freeze War. All right, let's see if these uh, little bad boys here leave a mark on the wall when you peg it really hard. So right, that over there is a blank wall. There's nothing on it because, you know, these little things will knock down frames if you throw them hard enough. But we'll see if they actually leave a mark on the wall. I'm about to peg them really hard. All right, here we go. All right, that was fun. <laughs> so as you can see, there's no mark. It's clean. That goes to show you that these little, uh, little squishy things are wall safe. They do not leave a mark. Nice. Now let's try another test. Say you're playing this game, throw, throw, burrito, throw, throw, avocado, in your living room, and you have a TV. Obviously, sometimes you might not be able to move your TV out of the way so you know you're playing this game but what if one of these little plushies hits your TV well let's test it out now my TV here has lines on it you can see a line right there you can see right here there's three lines that go across it so this was not 
this line was already here just in case these little things make something. So let's see what happens when I throw these little things at the TV. All right, it didn't do anything. I didn't uh, necessarily peg them. I threw them at the TV, but uh, as you can see, the TV safe. So I would say these little things are TV safe, just in case you were wondering if this would be, you know, dangerous for any kind of big screen TV you have. I don't recommend you doing it though. Um, but just in case, you know, anything happens, uh, these are soft. But I'm not saying that it will not break your TV. I'm just saying that just in case, maybe these are TV safe. Who knows? Nice. So this game looks great. The production value is awesome. The colors they chose for the theming is great. And it's a lot of fun. I got to play this with a few of my nephews and it was really, really fun throwing it at them. And they were having fun throwing it at us. And since they were little kids, they were having fun throwing it at each other. I also must say that playing this with adults was also extremely satisfying. Throwing it at each other, dodging, and just having a good time. I do recommend playing this game with adults and kids as well. However, when we played with kids, it was a little harder to follow the rules. So we had to modify it just a little bit. But they had a lot of fun throwing these burritos and avocados at each other, which is kind of the point of the game. So after playing about an hour, I noticed that one of the avocados started tearing around the brown area and the green area. So even though these toys are fairly soft, they're not very durable. They seem to tear fairly easily. That being said, it is a fun game and I do recommend it for adults and kids. Thanks for watching this video, and if you want to see more unboxings, there's a lot more in the channel. Burritos. Dun dun dun.